have? What is this? Hello. Hello, cats. Hello. Oh, he got it. I almost lost a finger, but he got it. Being all growly at the other cats. He's chewing it as fast as he can. He's under the big log pile here. Eating it whole almost. It's gone. He inhaled it. Today on In the Woodyard, I've got a trailer load full of wood. It needs to be stacked. Time to get to work. Here we go. How's that looking? Oh, we got wood. So the other day, I did some stacking here. I stacked this here, some stuff over here, because we had a couple uh, trailer loads full. And today, I think we're gonna process a little bit more wood over in the splitter. We're gonna split some more of the rounds that I have cut down. So I gotta get this stuff stacked. Also, I need my trailer because tomorrow, first thing in the morning, I have a delivery, so gotta empty it out. So stacking happens right now. So we're about to do some splitting. We got everything hooked up here. I took the uh, tarp we had on the tractor off, I mean on the splitter, threw it down and the cats seem to uh, like their new toy. <laughs> For some reason they think it's fun to play around on the tarp. They're insane, but that's okay. Cats are like that. Okay, time to split.
like the Easton Maid? That's the question. Are you a fan of Easton Maid? Well, we split a trailer load full. It's over there by the power. We're gonna stack, do a little stacking if I get this done. Cause the next thing I have to do is I have an order first thing tomorrow morning for two face cords of hardwood. It's going to the pizza place. He needs more wood. So I'm gonna load up two face cords right now into the trailer and that'll be ready. And the reason I'm doing it now is cause I have to go in the morning and I want to be able to just go. And tonight it's supposed to start raining. We're supposed to get like a half an inch of rain, I guess, overnight and then during the day tomorrow. It's supposed to warm up to close to 40 degrees. Right now it's about 35. So I'm gonna get that done, load it up, and then take the trailer and park it over there in the gravel so I get off all this mush, cause it's starting to thaw out again. It's getting, you can see by the tires on the uh, trailer and the tractor and everything, they're getting all big and puffy because we've got slimy, slippery, slippy, snotty stuff. So I'm gonna load up wood right now. So there, the trailer is loaded. I've got a little more than two face cords. I threw some extra stuff in, so I had a couple chunks of some weird stuff over here that I couldn't tell what it was. I think it might be Aspen, but it was kind of in between the two piles over here because I put a bunch of cherry in, I put some birch in, I put a bunch of ash and some maple in, so it's gonna be a little bit of everything. So I'm gonna take this to the studio right now, my old, old, old wood yard. I'm gonna park the trailer because I have to go that way and that's, I gotta go that direction. So I'm gonna take it that way and I'm gonna be able to uh, just pick it up in the morning and go deliver this right away. And then I might go tomorrow to Al's dad's place, to Carl's place and pick up some wood because it's supposed to be raining tomorrow. And that'd be a good thing to do on a rainy day is do a road trip down there and get a, a load of locusts and oak. I think I'll do like a half and half mix. And some of that is gonna need to be resplit. Some bigger chunks he's got there. He's got some rounds that were never split that are pieces like this big. But it's it's been there for almost a year now and he cut it with standing dead. So I think it's gonna be good to go. And I'm gonna dump it probably on the uh, cement slab over there where the processor is. So I keep it out of the mud here and then uh, if I run out of this wood and that wood, which I will, I'll have that on hand just a little bit more. So I might as well do that on a rainy day. So I'm gonna take this right now. I'm gonna go uh, get rid of it and I gotta go take some care of some stuff. So that's it for today, folks. Poke the buttons, I'll be back tomorrow. 5.30 a.m. with another video for you. Come on back, it'll be fun. Between now and then, there's 900 waiting for you. Go watch some. Good night, Irene. Mm -hmm.